catch him kind of slipping or, or, or sleeping on bottom. I could just grab his leg and throw it in. But again, this is home base. When you guys let your leg ride slip below his knee, I don't have a leg ride anymore, okay? It's important that my leg that's in be above his knee. Everybody see that? It's gotta be somewhere on his thigh. And then my ankles are always crossed and my knees are always wide. Okay, now we're gonna talk about our first turn, which I use more as a setup than an actual turn. All right, so we're getting our legs, yeah, getting our legs in, getting our ankles crossed. Now all I want this guy to do is this, whatever arm opposite of my leg in, I just want him to put it down by his side for now. Okay, whatever arm opposite of my leg ride, I want him to put it down. I don't want it straight out. I don't want it in front. I just want it down by his side. Okay, now all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna act like my body is an airplane taking off and I'm gonna go from my leg ride side across his body to his shoulder and I'm gonna arch my back as hard as I can. Okay, we call this shock in his back. So I'm gonna act like I'm an airplane taking off and then I'm gonna shock my back right here. See how I rolled his hips open? Okay, and started turning his belt buckle to the ceiling. A lot of people call this like helicopter in the leg or swing in the leg. I don't like just swinging the leg because when I swing the leg, it puts me here. When I go to my hip on the side away from my leg, he can turn into me and get me in some squirrely positions. Now we'll talk about that and we got some positions that we can beat that with, but I want you to come 45 degrees across his back and get your chest out over his opposite shoulder, okay? So we're gonna have our legs in, knees wide. I want his arm down, like an airplane taking off. And then right when my chest gets to his shoulder, I'm gonna arch my back, I'm gonna smash my belt buckle right into his low back right here. Boom, right there. Notice, my left knee went wide, my chest is tall, okay? And I'm still arching. In a match, I want, I want my outside knee almost floating. I want all my body weight right here on his hips, okay? We have to get that down in order to be able to turn the best guys. Okay. There's some guys that'll take a lot of punishment down there. Okay, But if I'm shocking his back and then falling to my hip, I'm going to lose a good position of power. All right? Somebody, somebody.